Hey guys, um, I just wanted to quick, you know, chat with you about the post yesterday and kind of help you secure success club or help three people um, before the end of the month. So we really have about six days left. You have till the 29th. Um, so you have some time. You have a full week, which is plenty of time if you've been building those relationships, connecting and forming some people to invite them to challenge groups or to follow up. So I posted yesterday just some seven things that maybe you're struggling with. So I wanted to go over the top ones that you guys were kind of connecting about or struggling with. And the first one was posting invites. You guys, this is simple. This is something you should be doing every single week. Now, if you're a brand new coach, this is not going to be like duh stuff for you. But if you've been a coach for three, four, five, six plus months, this should be something that's scheduled into your week weekly. This should be something that you are inviting to and advertising every single week about a challenge group, whether it's for you know February 29th or it is for March 15th. You should be advertising that because you want to start those conversations now. Sometimes success club does not just happen like that and you need those four weeks to really cultivate and build those relationships. So you should be posting invitations and inviting people into your challenge groups both on your social media page and in private messaging. Now the only way you can private message invite is if you are adding to your network three to five people every single day and you're answering those messages and you're forming and you're asking questions. What do you do for fitness? What do you struggle with? What do you do for work? What, how many kids do you have? You know, do you eat out a lot? Do you, you know, asking them so that way when they are like, you know, I'm, I'm tired and well, I don't have time to make a meal or eating healthy is too complicated. 21 day fix answers almost everybody's problem when it comes to eating. But the only way you're going to know that is if you're forming and chatting. So that's number three and we'll talk about that in a minute. But posting invites, you need to be posting those weekly. So I'm gonna share some um, examples that have worked well for me in the past. Um, you're going to have to come up with a graphic for it because it needs to be authentic to you. It needs to be who your followers relate with. But I will give you the words and you can kind of connect with it and mix it up to make it sound like more like you. But I'll give you that template and that guide. So I want you all tonight to post an invite, inviting to your challenge group, whatever that is. Even if it's on Monday the 29th, the way that On Demand is set up and the way that we deliver meal plans, they can order their challenge pack today. They might get it next Monday or Tuesday, but we can get them started. So I want every single one of you to post an invite tonight, tonight, and I want you to post it in this group when you do. Um, now, remember what I said last week, timing is everything. So don't say, oh, well, I have time at six, I'm gonna post it at six. Create your post at six, and then hop back on around 8.30, 9 o'clock, copy, paste, so create, earlier if you don't have time to create and post later, but don't post at six, post at another prime time, 9 30, 10 o'clock, whenever your traction seems to be a little bit more. So you have to be posting those invitations. Number three was the other one that you guys were talking about and I kind of touched on it, you know, inviting privately. You can't invite privately if you're not forming, if you're not connecting, if you're not building those relationships. I don't really invite privately all the time, but I've been doing it more and more lately because I'm just trying to get out of my own head and I'm just in building conversation. I'm inviting, Hey, did you know that you struggle with fitness and you're struggling with trying to figure out, did you know that I run online health groups? Did you know that I run online support groups using some of the programs and tools that have helped me lose my 30 pounds of baby weight? Oh, you struggle with community? You should join my online challenge group. It's a group of women who are cheering each other on about you know, losing weight and watching our nutrition and just it's a really good environment. Think about why you got started. And if I would have never invited you or your coach would have never invited you, what would you be missing out on? And Janelle touched on that on the national wake up call today. You need to remind yourself that you're offering them a solution. And if they're not ready for that solution, that's okay. Or if they take it the wrong way, that's okay. They'll be back because you're planting that seed. But you have to plant that seed. And the more people you get to say no, the closer you are to that yes. So when you're inviting privately, it's not just automatically messaging someone and say, hey, join my challenge group. It should be with people that you've been talking with for about a week 10 days, two weeks, maybe even a month the conversation's gone on and you just haven't had the courage to invite. So inviting privately 
is, is where that relationship is built it's behind the scenes. But they're going to be more comfortable in saying yes if you're doing what we talked about number two, which is posting jabs throughout the week. And I put examples of, um, of po I'm, I'm, I'll post them, um, about what jabs are and jabs about Shakeology. And jabs are basically just sharing why they're working for you and the benefit of them. So I do them almost every day. Almost every day I'm jabbing at Shakeology, I'm jabbing at my 21 day fix plan, I'm jabbing at my exercise, I'm jabbing at my accountability partners. You know, all of those things that create our challenge groups as our challenge groups. If you've been posting consistently your workout, which I've been seeing a lot of you do, now take it one step further and now post your breakfast every day or post a meal every single day in addition to your fitness. Because now you're talking about the fitness, now you're talking about the nutrition plan, and you need to be talking about Shakeology, water, community, whatever. Posting those jabs, we call them jabs, throughout the week, it's going to help people understand when you invite them or when you post a challenge group invite of what they're getting invited to. It's less questions, they feel a little bit more comfortable, they're familiar with the 21 day fix, I can't tell you how many times I've asked people, have you heard of the 21 day fix? Yeah, I've seen you post about it. So you have to be posting about it. It's okay to reference the plan that you're doing. Um, the other one was you guys were saying that you speak too much at first. We are in a business where the more you ask questions and let them talk, the better the chances of them committing. If you are constantly, if they say, yes, I'm in a challenge, yes, I'm interested, and you're blasting them with, this is what's included, this is what it costs, this is when we start, this is what's involved, blah, 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 here's what you get, without ever asking them, like, what's their struggle, what's their current situation like, what's their work schedule like, and asking them about them, it's pretty, you're taking the personal out of it. You're not being personal about it at all. You're just trying to get the sale. So when you do a challenge group post, or let's say in your invite privately, they say, yeah, that was, sounds like something I'm interested in. Okay, perfect. You know, can you tell me a little bit about what you're currently doing? Okay, so especially if this is coming from a challenge group. Hey, I saw that you're interested in my challenge group post, come, you know, my challenge group post for the challenge group coming up on X date. I would love to share more information with you, but first, can I get to know you a little bit more? Do you work? Do you have kids? What are you currently doing for your health and fitness? What have you tried in the past? And let them answer that. And they're gonna tell you that kind of stuff. They're gonna say, okay, awesome, I can totally relate. I am a mom, I have two kids. You know, nutrition was always really hard for me. I was able to work out, but the nutrition piece was so hard for me to get a handle on. So, the 21 day fix has really helped me understand the kinds of foods I need as well as how much and how often. And it's really been a lifesaver for me and helped me um, lose my last 30 pounds as well as Shakeology. Shakeology has been a brainless meal for me. I have it on the go. I know that I'm full of nutrients and vitamins. It's really helped with my energy levels and my digestion. You know, it's really helped me that way. And I think because you work full time, you have six kids, you are a stay at home mom and you're busy you know, X, Y, Z, I think this program would really work for you. Would you like to know more about it? Yes? Okay, great. Now I'm going to share with them, like, the brief description of my group. And I'm sharing this document. Th this is what my groups are. We focus on workouts. We focus on nutrition. We teach you how to incorporate Shakeology. In the group, you're going to get meal plans, shopping lists, daily accountability, and I'm going to be there to help you along the way, as well as checking in with you weekly um, and if you need more, then we check in more often. So does this sound like something that you would be interested in? Yes? Okay, awesome. How much is it? Well, let me break down for you what you receive with your package, to your full package. And I break down. They get the program. They get the containers. They get the um, book. They get the three-day quick fix. They get the quick start guide. They get the shaker cup. They get um, 30 days of Shakeology and I list the flavors that they can have and they get 30 days access to on demand and they get me as their personal coach. And then I say again, and then in the group, that's where we really get to the sport of the meal plans, the shopping list, the snack options and recipes and things like that. So all of this is bundled into this price of 140, which is awesome for the month of February because it's on discount. So I know that was a lot of information. I know that you may feel a little bit overwhelmed, but I'm an open book, so what questions do you have for me, or are you ready to commit to this? It's all about them. Do they have more questions? Are they ready to commit? What can you do for them? And so you need to make, make sure that you're asking quick questions and not expecting for them to say, yes, I'm interested in the challenge you're here, purchase now. It might take two, three, four days. That's why it's important to get those invites out early 
so that you're not scrambling the night before going, oh crap, someone wants to purchase on Thursday, but I told them the group started on Monday. Well, you know, they can definitely join, but they're going to get the program a little late. So making sure you're asking them questions. And again, like follow that script. And you're going to have to change things if people's answers change or the dialogue is different, but you can at least use that as a guideline. And that should help with number five. So a lot of the times what will happen with closing the deal is they say it's too much money. Okay, $140 is a lot of money. We really can't do that right now. Okay, I totally understand. I can relate with that. Um, you know, we do have another option. It doesn't come with the group or it doesn't come with the meal plan. But I would be willing, or Shakeology, but I'd be willing to check in with you a few times a week if you'd like. We have the base kit, which gives you the program, the, nutri the portion control kit, and the booklet to help get you going. Is that something you're interested in? That's only, that is $59.85. Would that be more budget friendly for you? I don't give them, I don't just say, okay, sorry, here you go, bye, you can't buy a challenge pack. I give them another option and maybe that's not for them. So then I say, hey, you know, you can do the 30 day on demand access for free. All you, have to, you do have to put in your, your credit card, but it's free for the first 30 days. You can try out some trainers, plug them into something. Maybe they just need the portion fix. Maybe they need a three day refresh. Keep asking them questions to see what fits. And then if nothing, if they're like, no, I just financially can't do anything, you say, you know what, I completely understand. My next free group is on enter date. Would you like me to invite you to that when I get ready to open it? And then you can write them down and say, that's awesome for a free group. I need to follow up. And if they say no to that, I'm going to say, okay, I'll keep, up, keep you on my follow-up list and I'll touch base with you next month and maybe we can revisit. So you have to, like, don't just leave them hanging. Give them something. You let them know you're going to follow up. That way you're opening that door so that next month when you follow up, they're not like, why is she bothering me again? You've already told them I'm going to follow up. And then you're going to write them down and then you're going to make sure you follow up with them. Okay? But I think the most important thing that you guys need to be doing consistently is, number one, you need to change your mindset if you've been thinking that, like, oh, people are just going to come to me and as soon as I get five people, I'm going to have 10 my 10 points. That's not the case. If you want to hit Success Club 5, that's three people, you need to talk to 30 people. You need to have 27 no's to get three yeses, okay? That's really how it works. One in 10 people that you talk to are going to commit to your challenge pack, okay? So if you're not hating Success Club, then you need to be talking to more people. And to talk to more people, you need to be adding people to your network. You need to be putting those invite posts out there so that you can invite people, so that you have people to talk to and to connect with about the challenge group, okay? I hope this was helpful. I can't wait to see your guys' invite posts tonight, and I want you to continue posting those jabs and hooks throughout the week. And the jabs are those little jabs that like what the 21 day fix is doing for you and posting pictures with your containers and your food and posting Shakeology photos and posting workout photos and posting community photos and updates on your challengers and a success story. And those are all little jabs. So that when you do the hook, the AKA, AKA the invite post, people have an awesome idea of what they're getting themselves into. So I hope this helps. I hope you guys found this helpful. And I look forward to talking to you guys later. Yeah.